Hi, my name is Greg Christian. Welcome. Uh, I want to talk to you about vision today, creating a vision for a new food system. And wherever you work, it's, uh, it, it, there's things that can be improved. You can use less water, less energy, maybe serve more local food. Maybe if you're serving local food, go into organic food. Um, if, you're, if you're cooking all processed food, maybe just start doing scratch cooking. If you're doing all scratch, scratch cooking, uh, uh, you know, getting organic food into that scratch cooking. And often with vision, we're not really trained in creating a vision. In our, uh, our education system sometimes takes away our creativity. And how do we, uh, how do we think about how do we want it to be? And so I often invite people to think about how do you want it to be wherever you work? How do you want it to look in five years or 10 years? or even better, 20 years. When you go, the further out you go, the more in your heart you're gonna end up being. Because if I ask you, how do you want it next year? That's gonna be all linear head stuff. Um, but if I say, how do you want it to be in 20 years? You can't think about that. So you have to imagine it. And in the creating of a vision, what you n need to know is it's okay if you don't know all the steps that it's gonna take to get there. It's okay if you haven't done it before. And then, and then the hard part is usually embrace, embracing the tension between how it is and how you want it to be. So this is the current reality. This is the vision. And if you can share this vision and hold on to this vision, then current reality will come up to vision. I learned that from Peter Senge. Uh, one of my favorite uh, systems thinkers. And we aren't uh, totally comfortable with that tension between current reality and vision. And so we tend to uh, often forget about vision and, and then it falls back down into current reality. So, and then the last thing about vision, which is really important, is sharing that vision with uh, multiple stakeholders. It's a little bit of a project and a lot of us aren't trained in that either. But uh, if your vision isn't shared, it's usually less powerful and it operates in a bubble. And when you take a couple body blows, when stuff doesn't work, it's easy to forget about vision. But if it's shared amongst management and all the other stakeholders, stakeholders involved in your company, and who you're serving, then there's power to that vision. Thanks.